Planning your progression for monetization. The IBE is going to help define priorities for system upgrades, and there are usually implications to like capital planning over a multi-year period. Combined with that smart tech review, you should be able to feel pretty confident right now about the devices, and you really should be able to start developing that plan moving forward of progression. And that progression plan, that can take a while. It could really span multiple years, but it's going to also define those standards for actual device replacement for big projects and incremental repair opportunities. So smart device standards are an output of progression planning, but the exercise, it should be more extensive in scope, right? Because what works best uh, to define requirements around objectives and goals really needs to be the focus. What can be done that's going to move the needle? Before really jumping in feet first, take some time and step back and give some thought to converting data into knowledge. What data do I need to make better decisions? So I'm going to give you three areas to think about. Think holistically, right? You need this from the site level objectives across major information systems, and you may need to tap into personnel outside engineering, talking about operations, ERP level users, and, and beyond. Number two, think from a machine or a process perspective. It's a little more captive here, and that's going to really be able to zone in on what's important to the control engineering, ENI teams, and things like that. And then, I've said this in the past, think big but act small. So you can start with that big objective, but focus in on a functional area that you can really zone in on and make an impact, prove it out, and move from there. So these are really creative thinking types of, type of exercises. And when you do that, combine it with an IBE and that smart tech review, oh wow, you're on such a great path to really make a good educated decision on the types of devices you need moving forward. If you want to see an example of a progressive planning journey, check out our smart manufacturing guide and you'll find some really cool templates in there and you'll be able to use them directly yourself as you can start defining your own devices and specifications. So once you have those devices specified and, and you're ready to, to move forward with that progression plan, start giving more consideration to that network itself. Network design, performance, and reliability really get critical as you start connecting more and more data and you're pulling into it to make those decisions. You can do this. Now go start planning for your progression for modernization.